When is the church going to wake up and realize that the devil is a loose on earth? He on earth looking to get in people's mind to make them do and say evil things to each other. We up here having church. You up here looking at your enemy. Don't know that the devil is in you. Jesus, Jesus. You up here, your supervisor asked you to do something. I ain't doing nothing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How in the world are you talking about you a believer and you bucking up against authority? That's right. That's authority. That's right. Then you wonder why your children won't listen to you. That's they won't listen to you because you ain't listening to your supervisor. That's right. Come on. That's good. That's real good. See, we want to get so spiritual. God say, I ain't no chunky. Don't come to me but pay your bills. Don't come to me because you want some money. He said, I'm looking for a person that will walk in my ways, that will walk in my statutes. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Well, I ain't come, I, I ain't come for that kind of church. You know what? You, you what you're telling God is I'm, I'm just religion. I want to I want to preach it. I want another doctrine. You got people in churches want to shout and dance, but they don't know the word. What? Because if it was just biblical, that, baby, it'll be just one page. Right. Just praise and dance. That's right. But here it is. We got this Bible. Got how many pages? And we talking about, oh, I can get mine from TV. Well, the Bible says not to forsake the assembly. You sitting up here changing laws in the realm of the spirit, not understanding. You're acting like a bastard because a true son know how to submit to the voice of the king. Yeah, we're talking about a beast because people want to get it all twisted. But it's Christmas time. It's time to show love. Excuse me, when I read the Bible, it says show love 365 days a year. Why y'all want to show love just on December the 25th? All right, all right. Show love at all times. We want to show love at all times yeah. to each other. We don't got so we don't got so worldly in the ministry, in the church. God said you're supposed to be a sore thumb. You're supposed to stick out with power. You're supposed to stick out with authority. But the only thing we know how to do is raise hell in the church. When people can't have their way, they go from one church to another church. One church to another church. Because you got a bunch of renegades, they don't want to submit. Do you understand? God is not going to send you somewhere where you can run it. That's right. That's right, Apostle. He ain't going to do that. Because he going to put you somewhere that somebody going to call your spade or spade. But the demon of the beast on the inside of you want to try to challenge authority. And you say, where did that come from? It comes from your childhood. When your mama tried to tell you what to do, you want to fight her. That's why when you see these little kids tell you to shut up. You shut up. No, what you're teaching them how to be is bastards. What you're doing is teaching them how to rebel against authority. So if they don't want to listen to their teacher, if they don't want to listen to you, guess what? They ain't going to listen to God. They're going to become a beast because don't nobody know how to tame that monster that you hate. Then you want to get mad. And then a lot of times we want to talk about black on black crime. I hear you, Holy Ghost. He said we want to talk about we need to save each other. We need to uh, fight for our black. God said we need to go back and train our children. Amen. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. You can't expect the teacher to train your child. I know that's right. I know that's right. Training starts at home. At home. That's right. Come on here. It's tight, but it's tight. If you can't make them obey, the teacher ain't going to make them obey. That's right. Then we want to get mad because they're killing one another. You know why they're killing one another? Because you ain't putting no God in them. A beast, what I told you what a beast. A beast will hurt another beast. So why do you think they fighting each other? Why do you think we killing each other? Because the beast nature, you know what? You jealous of him about some shoes. You gonna kill somebody about some shoes? You gonna kill somebody about a woman? You gonna kill somebody about a man? You a beast? Mm -hmm. All these men in the world, you think I'm gonna kill somebody about a man? I know that's right, Apostle. You just showing me you ain't the right one for me. Mm -hmm. But I ain't gonna go to jail for that. I know that's right. We sitting up there like, cause she disrespected me. Baby, you know what? You disrespected yourself when you call yourself a beast. Yeah. Then you mad because she called you a bee. It's quiet, but that's what we do. Yes. We call ourselves, I'm a bad bee. But then when she called you a bee, you want to fight her. <laughs> you see how ignorant we doing? That's a beast. 